What's going on guys? Etika from the Etika World Network here to bring you some new stuff. We got watchdogs in the building and I'm gonna be doing this a little bit odd now. This may not necessarily be a new series that I'm starting, but I got the game Watch Dogs because I'm a huge Ubisoft fan. I love Assassin's Creed, and so Watch Dogs, of course, was on the list for me to get next. This game is amazing to me so far because <laughs> this is a very complex game, and I think that it takes a certain level of appreciation to kind of understand the mechanic. Like, it's, it's kind of hard to put into words, but if you go in there expecting it to be like GTA, you're going to be in for a really big disappointment. But the game itself, it's so difficult. <laughs> like the stealth and all, it, it, it's, oh man, there's so much to explain to you dudes. But we're, we're not doing a playthrough necessarily. We're just going to be randomly fucking around because there's a lot to do in this game. And I find it really fun, so I just want to show you guys a day of me messing around in Watch Dogs with tomfoolery and all that other stuff. Now, I didn't really beat the game yet. I'm actually still very early. I think I'm only on like story mission number three. So, you know, I, I haven't done any progress yet, but there's so many other things to do. And there's online battles as well, too. So I want to do everything. We're just going to mess around right now. Generally mess around and see what happens. So now this is Watch Dogs. Now you play as Aiden here, you can run around. And as you guys all probably know by now, you can hack shit. And the hacking is what really makes this game stand out. All right, here we go. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, I'm on a mission? Race through locations to attract police. Oh, wait. Oh, I think this is a story mission. No, I got to quit this because actually I'm playing this game right now with my girlfriend. And my girlfriend, she's heavy into Watch Dogs and Assassin's Creed and all that other stuff. So, you know, I don't, I don't want to do the story mode without her. But she said it was okay for me to mess around online and play with against other people on our friends list and stuff like that. So I'm not going to um I'm not going to overstep my boundaries with doing story, right. but we're gonna mess around. I can deal with Jordy's job, some kind of driving contract, delivering a guy somewhere. This won't be a typical taxi service. The trick with these jobs is avoiding the cops. Yeah, but that thing that he's talking about, don't don't even worry about that. We're not even gonna do any story. What we're gonna be doing is just messing around the city a bit. So um Let's just let's just drive around a little bit and see what happens because just like in um, just like in Assassin's Creed, there's a lot of different events that can happen as you're driving around the city or walking around the city, you know. But you guys pretty much understand the gist of how this game works for the most part. You hack stuff, and um, there's a story as well, which is really compelling. Like there's a, actually a lot of a lot of value in the story because you know it's kind of creepy, and there's basically this big organization that has cameras everywhere and they're taking over people's privacy and this is Chicago by the way so there's there's a lot of content to the game there's been a lot of negative and positive reviews more on the negative side and I'm not surprised because this game looks a lot like GTA but it doesn't play like it so I think a lot of people go in there with bad expectations whoops maybe I should maybe I should get out of the fucking car oh but all right let's just wait for something to happen because I'll, well we, well this is not really the gist of it you don't really wait for stuff to happen but right now I need to get me some money because I just bought some guns and uh, I, I lost a lot of cash, so we gotta find people to hack so we can get into their bank accounts and get ourselves some goddamn cash. Cause, oh man. All right, so check this out, right? All right, this girl, she has a system key on her phone for some reason. And you can use the system key to create hacks. And the hacks do different things depending on how you make them. So this is the, this is the wheel, right? And you can craft things here. So I can craft a frag grenade using materials and one of those materials could be a system key but obviously I don't need that to make a bomb so you know I can use the system key however to make a jam com which is a sort of interference device that like if I throw it out there it'll turn off everyone's cell phones cause mass panic and disarray it's awesome but I mostly create the frag grenades because you can do stuff like this oh shit watch out <laughs> oh shit yeah kinda crazy kinda crazy but I need, I still need money though. I still gotta find somebody to rob, man. I still gotta find somebody to rob. Or rather, I gotta find me an ATM, man. Because here's how it works. You find somebody, you steal their money using the phone, and then you withdraw the money through an ATM. Um, this guy, we can hack him, but all we're gonna do is listen into his personal conversation. I don't really care about listening into his conversation that much, so I'm not going to hack him. Um, but here we go, ATM but we don't have any money ready to pick up, so we gotta keep driving around robbing people. Northbound train arriving shortly. Man, how do we find people to rob? 
Uh, oh, oh, here we okay. go. Okay, take it easy. Uh, all right, so as you guys can see, on the right of the screen, there's a fixer contract. So that's, a fixer is another hacker like me. And that's our chance to Get go out. and find him. We're gonna steal this guy's car though, because you oh know, we're moving around a little too slow. Okay, good. And he didn't call the police too, so he lucked out there. Um, we gotta find people to rob, Ben. We gotta find people to rob. Maybe if we go to a different part of the city. Um, okay. Yeah, like I said, guys, you're kind of being thrown in without any kind of explanation. I feel that's how this game was. You know, I didn't really feel like they explained much to us in the beginning, and it got a little bit hard to understand certain things, but it makes sense as you play it. With time, you'll get used to it eventually. You know, you just can't go in there expecting a different game experience. So now... Oh, look, okay, you see? This girl, she has a bank account that's open that we can hack. So we're about to take her cash. And there we go, we got $280, just like that. Yay. By the way, my shirt is Watch Dogs too. yeah. <laughs> yeah, man, I'm one hell of a tool. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Um, now, right here, this is the contract, I think, for the other hacker. You gotta find it, though. Okay, here we go. Yeah, a fixer is another hacker. They just don't call them hackers for some reason. I don't know why. But, okay, so, fixers are trying to close a job, and I'm providing a decoy. I draw the cops with the ride they left me, and we all walk away happy. Okay, so... I'm not sure exactly what... Oh wait, oh wait, oh wait, I gotta go down the street and get a car. I think I gotta get the car there. Yeah, okay, here we go. Wait, isn't this the mission I just got on? Hey, I think it's this. Okay. Wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. Acquire what? The car? Oh my god! Yeah, Chicago's not ready for me. This is a really fast car. The driving mechanics are kind of crazy. Open that door. Yeah, I basically, you hack the door and you open it. So the hacking is kind of your way to have an advantage over everybody else. And it's one advantage that you really need because what I'm about to tell you is going to break your heart. It is impossible to do drive-bys in this game. Can you believe that? Race to the target locations to attract the police. Okay. Oh, this is basically a checkpoint mission. Alright, man. Here we go. Oh my god! I'm still alive after. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. Oh my god, there's 19 of these. I suck at driving in all these open world games, man. GTA. Oh, it's even worse. Oh my god. Oh yeah, I made it. There you go. Let's go! Police are after me? Why? What did I do? Oh my god, alright. So, the only way to lose the police... Oh wait, we're gonna lose our checkpoint. Go, 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 go. Oh wait, we're trying to attract the attention of the police by using the car of the other hacker. Alright, I think I get it. Man, we are really kind of fucking up right now. Alright, here we go. Oh my god, we're gonna lose, we're gonna lose, we're gonna lose, we're gonna lose, yep, it's over, it's over. Fuck, man, I suck at this! I suck at driving in this game! Any open world game, man, yeah, it's kind of... Alright, so, yeah, you guys got to see me mess up in a mission for the first time. Was it fun? Did you enjoy yourselves? I sure the hell did not. Oh, whatever, screw this, I'm out of here. No, I'm not doing this. Screw this. I suck at driving. If anything, my girlfriend's a little bit better at driving in this game than I am. I can already hear the jokes. Whew. Oh yeah, by the way, I'm playing this on the PS4. I wish you could shut this light off, but whatever. But alright, so now let's find out it's a different mission to do. Or a matter of fact, let's, let's go online. So you, you can go online by accessing your cell phone, going to the online contacts app, and then um, online tailing. Let's try that. Test your stealth skills. Actually, you know what? No, no, no. We're not going to do that. In fact, I want to show you guys something else. We're going to do a... We're going to infiltrate a gang. Criminal convoy. No, no. Gang hideout. There we go. So now you guys are probably wondering what the hell is a gang hideout. Well, basically, this guy, he's trying to be a vigilante. And you sort of have like a reputation system in this game. So the more good deeds you do, then the... Um, yeah, the more good deeds you do in this game, 
then um, the, the better your reputation gets. And the worse, then I don't know. I don't really don't know what happens with you doing good or bad deeds. It's kind of not explained, you know? So this game is definitely lacking in some fields. But basically, I can infiltrate gang hideouts and take out certain people to raise up my reputation and to gain skill points, which I can use to enhance my skills in this game. Yeah, there's skills and levels and all that shit. 